Uh, bye, Gregory. I'll see you soon. Oh my goodness, I can't believe this. Gregory finally asked me on a date, but... Oh, I wasn't ready. I'm not prepared emotionally, and it's happening in just like a couple hours. What am I gonna do? Okay, Cassie. Oh, hi, Cassie. Help me. What are you doing in there? Well, I noticed that your blood pressure was rising and your heart rate was also rising. Are you okay? Are you in danger? No, help me. I'm not in danger. It's fine. You can back up a little bit. Personal space. Oh, Absolutely. So, uh, seems like you're going on a date with this Gregory. What? How did you even know that? Were you spying on me? I'm always spying on you. I'm kind of in your head, you know. I guess that's a good point. Uh, yes, Gregory and I may or may not be going on a date in a little bit. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so exciting. You've been waiting for this a while. You've written all about it in your diary. Hey, you're not supposed to know about my diary. Well, I do know all about your diary. Oh my gosh, helping. You better not tell Gregory anything about about what I wrote in there. Of course not. September 2nd, Gregory said hi to me today. No, 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 no. Stop, <laughs> stop, stop. Okay, okay, I, I get it. Help me. Look, I, I need your help. I I'm going on this date with Gregory in just a little bit, and I have no idea what I'm going to do. I've never been on a date before. You've never been on a date? I guess that makes sense. Oh my gosh, help me. What, what do I need to do? do? Do I need to put on makeup? My mom puts on makeup before she goes on dates with my stepdad. Should I put do a new outfit or something? Sure. Okay, um, oh, you know what? I think in my mom's bathroom she has some makeup, but she's currently in there. Oh, actually her door is open. Um, she might have went somewhere else. Okay, here. Gotta keep her voice down and don't distract me too much because we're gonna sneak in her bathroom, okay? Cassie, no one else can hear me besides you. I forget that sometimes. You've got a point. All right, come on, Helpy. All right, following Cassie, following Cassie on a secret spy mission, on a secret mission to get the makeup in the bathroom. Come on, just get in here. Okay. All right. Don't 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 slam the door. I didn't slam it. I was making sure it was locked. Oh. <gasps> Let me just go ahead and lock this one. All of this stuff up here looks cool. There's a big trunk and there's a mirror. Ooh, and there's a hair dryer and some other thing. Ooh, what does this thing do? Help me. Be careful. I don't want you breaking anything. Here, play with this rubber ducky. Oh my goodness, it's a rubber ducky. <laughs> now, while you're focused on that, let me just go ahead. Um, I guess, how does my hair look? Should I brush it? Well, it looks like your hair normally looks. I can maybe try to look up some other styles of hair if you'd like on Google. I don't know if I have time for that. Uh, maybe I should just wet it a little bit in the shower. Here, give me a second. All right. All right, and I'm just gonna end over so I just get my hair wet. Do you need help from Mr. Rubber Ducky? No, I don't need help. Thanks, Helpy, though. All right, turn that off. All right, um, it'll dry and it'll probably be fine. Uh, uh, thanks, Helpy. Um, of course, it's my new lucky Rubber Ducky. Maybe you should take it on your date. You'd probably impress Gregory with it. I don't know if I'm gonna impress Gregory with a Rubber Ducky. I'm gonna be honest, Helpy. What's well, like a really cool Rubber Ducky? It is a cool Rubber Ducky, but uh, I'm just gonna set this down. Um, okay, that's where my mom keeps her makeup. Let me just... Uh, uh, all right, and let me look and see if I can find anything good in here. Cassie, have you ever even done your own makeup before? Uh, of course I haven't done my own makeup. You know what? Maybe, if you want, Helpy can always do your makeup for you. I'm technically an AI robot, so I could just look up a tutorial online and follow that step by step. <gasps> Maybe we can even make you look like Roxanne Wolf. That would be really cool. She's your favorite, and she's Gregory's mother. I do like Roxanne Wolf. All right, do you want to do my makeup for me? Sure. All right, but you have to do a good job, Helpy. This is really important. All right, I'll try. All right, uh, have at it then. All right, here we go. Oh, no. Five hours later. Are you almost done, Helpy? And perfect. Oh, my goodness. I think the purple lipstick really seals the deal. Um, okay, well, I guess let me check it out. Um, let's make sure my mom isn't out here. All right, I don't see her anywhere. All right, let me take a look. <laughs> Do you love it? I thought you said you were going to look up a tutorial. I did. I looked up several tutorials on YouTube. I don't really know how I feel about it, Helpy. What do you mean? It looks, um, like makeup. It's just a bit striking is all. Oh, striking. Isn't that what you wanted? I did intense makeup tutorial, Roxanne Wolf edition. I don't know about intense makeup, Helpy. I think I need to wash this off. 
Really? You don't like it? Um, no, I don't think so. Oh, my goodness. Help he was supposed to be helpful, but I guess he wasn't very helpful right now, was he? I just don't think you're very good at makeup, Helpy, but it's fine. I've never done someone's makeup before. In fact, I've never even held a makeup brush. Oh, what am I supposed to do, Helpy? I'm just in my old silly outfit with my old silly hairstyle with my old silly face. Is Gregory even going to like me? Let me look up dating tutorials. Hold on. Okay, um, any luck? Cassie, what I'm finding online is that you mostly just need to be yourself. But what if he's expecting me to dress up all cute and wear a dress or have pretty makeup or pretty hair or pretty nails? Should, should I repaint my nails? Cassie, you have pretty hair and you have pretty nails and your outfit is really, really cool. Look, you just had Gregory over a little bit ago. He just left. And, well, um, the date is pretty soon, so I understand why you're freaking out. You have to understand, he likes you for you, Cassie. Don't you get that? I guess so. I just don't want to mess anything up, Helpy. I, this is our chance to finally explore the connection we have. And you do have a connection. I can feel it inside of you. It's a very strong connection, actually. It seems like you really, really like him. Do you love him? Do you want to marry him? I do like him a lot, but it's too early for all that love and marry stuff, okay? I can look up wedding venues. No, I think we're going to pass on that for now. Oh, I guess that makes sense. But remember, Cassie, if Helpy can help you with one thing, just remember, be yourself. Gregory obviously likes you for you, and he really liked the house, and he seems to really like, you know, hanging out with you and everything like that. So don't try to change yourself to fit in, or don't try to change yourself to make him like you more. It's not gonna work. You're pretty wise for such a little guy, you know that? Thank you. I found all of that on Google. Of course you did. Alright, well, I really don't have time to experiment with my look anymore. I, I really need to just start heading his way. I guess I'll order an Uber or something. I mean, I guess you're gonna come with me whether I like it or not, right? Yep. Like I said, I'm always in your head. <sighs> yep. Alright, well, just try and give me a little bit of privacy while I'm on this date. But if I need anything, I'll definitely let you know. Okay, Helpy? Absolutely. Helpy's so excited to go on the date with Gregory, just like Cassie. This is gonna be so fun. No, uh, he's, uh, uh, forget it. All right. I'm really excited. It's actually been a while since I've been here, and lucky for us, they're, they're open late, and, um, no one else is here because it is pretty late, so. <laughs> no, I, I love this arcade. It's, it's a lot of fun. I actually come here a lot with Roxanne, we play the, the games and stuff, so. Mm -hmm. It's a smaller place, but I, they have really good food, so. Uh, should we should we order some? Um, sure. Um, okay. Uh, let me take a look at the menu. Uh, they have, ooh, they have a burger. They have a double burger, sandwich, eggs, and bacon. Oh, they even have nuggies. I definitely, honestly, I might get a burger and some nuggies because I'm kind of hungry. I haven't had dinner yet, so uh, here's the menu. Thank you. I'll take some fries. Um, do you like mustard? Uh, yeah, it's, it's okay. I can't seem to. I mean, oh, um, can you, oh, can you get it? Um, uh, yeah, there we go. Just okay. to... I know it's kind of weird, but I kind of like mustard on my fries, so. Oh, um, in interesting. <laughs> yeah. Desserts. Ooh, soda, sandwiches, eggs and bacon, double burger. Okay, you said you're getting a burger and some nuggies. Yeah. Um, I think so. What are you gonna get? I don't know. I'm trying to figure it out. I think I might do, honestly, either a double burger or a sandwich. Which one do you think sounds better? Well, I don't know what kind of sandwiches they have, but... I, I dropped, oh, um, dropped the menu on the floor. <laughs> I see. Uh, well, I guess the waiter isn't out for us to take our orders yet. Anyway, um, do you want to go uh, play some games instead while we wait? Yeah, sure. Okay. Um, the, my favorite game is actually over here. It's uh, uh, this one. Uh, the Papa Bubbles one? I love Papa Bubbles. Oh my gosh. I've actually never played the two-player one, but my high score in the single-player one is like 30,000 or something crazy. <laughs> Wait, really? My high score in Bob and Bubbles is like 45,000. That's really cool, though. That's really awesome that you like this game, Cassie. Thanks. <laughs> um, uh, okay, I, I guess, uh, um, I kind of want to use the, um, restroom. Oh! Um, yeah, um, you, you know where it is, right? It's just right. Uh, yeah, I, I, I know, I, I know where it is. Um, I guess I'll, I'll be 
right back. <laughs> um, okay. Oh my gosh, Cassie, how stupid are you? 30,000 is a high score, but his high score is literally 45,000. Okay, I feel like I'm about to have a panic attack. My anxiety is so bad right now. <sighs> okay, just chill out, Cassie. I feel like I really need to talk to somebody. Help me. Help me. Help me. Help me. Are you here? Help me. Hi, Cassie. Oh, hey, help me. I kind of just needed to come in here for a second, and I feel like I'm being so awkward and dumb. Well, you kind of are being a little bit awkward. Hey! Well, I, maybe I shouldn't have ordered so much food. I, I ordered a burger and chicken nuggies. Maybe, was that a bad idea? No, not at all. You're a hungry girl. Get whatever you want to eat. Look, Gregory also ordered a double burger and some nuggies, and he was eating some of the french fries. I guess that's a good point. I just, I, I feel like he's judging me. And then we went up to the arcade game, and, and I said, oh, this is one of my favorite games. My high score is 30,000, and you know what he said? Wait, you only have a high score of 30,000 on Poppin' Bubbles? Is that bad? I thought it was a good <laughs> high score. Hey, that is not funny. It's not that bad. Oh Look, my gosh. I heard what he said. He has a score of 45,000, which I have to be honest is pretty good in Poppin' Bubbles. I know, that's really good in Poppin' Bubbles, but I thought I was. <sighs> I thought I my high score was good, and. Well, what if he's just trying to one up me? Cassie, he's not trying to one up you. You guys are on a date. He likes you. You have to remember that. Thank you. I guess it's just, I don't know, I feel so stupid. Maybe I should have never done this. No, Cassie, don't overthink this. Remember, he asked you on a date because he wanted to go on a date with you, okay? He clearly really likes you, and the whole pop and bubbles thing was probably just him trying to impress you. You're right. He does like me. He's not judging me for how much I order or my high score in a stupid game. Okay. Your heart rate is rising again. Are you okay? Do I need to take you home? No, what you do don't need to take me home. I just need to calm down, I think. I got you. Look, Cassie, let me give you a couple tips. Gregory really likes to laugh, you know? He loves when people are funny. So maybe go out there and you can really woo him with some jokes. You know what? Uh, that's a good idea. I I guess I, I'm not the greatest at cracking jokes, but I can I can definitely try. Um, Why did the chicken cross the road? I don't know why. I don't know. You're supposed to give me a funny answer. You're supposed to be the funny one here. Uh, to, 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 to get to the other side? <laughs> was, was that good? Really? Yeah, that was perfect. Okay. Gregory's gonna love your jokes. Maybe I am good at telling jokes then. Okay. All right. So I guess tell jokes. Um, look cute. Be funny. Be funny. Don't embarrass myself and make him like me. Absolutely. Well, he already likes you. So check. True. I checked Mark on the box up. Oh, okay. Um, I think I'm ready to go back out there. You really think I can do this? Absolutely. Just remember, make him laugh. He's going to love you. Well, not like that, but like, who knows? Maybe. I mean, I did already start looking at wedding venues, and there's some pretty cool ones Stop around here. Stop looking at wedding venues. We're not getting married for a long time, Helpy, if we ever even do. Ooh, she's thinking about it. Cassie and Gregory sitting in a tree. Hey, stop it. Stop it. Help and G. G. Why do you have a hard time spelling that? I don't know. Me neither. Okay, I'm going to go back out there. You got to disappear, okay? Scat. Okay, fine. All right. Oh, okay, Cassie. It's just you and Gregory and kind of helping in the back of your head. But that's fine. You got this. You're, you you look great. Uh, The hair looks good. Um, No more makeup residue. Cool. All right. It's good that you don't have that makeup on anymore. <sighs> Thanks, Helpy, for the boost of confidence. All right, I'm going back out. Um, oh, uh, hey, Gregory, I see you're playing Poppin' Bubbles. Uh, sorry about that. I just, um, I had some, uh, uh, makeup, um, on my hands and I wanted to get it off. Makeup on your hands? You're... Are you wearing makeup? Uh, no, I, um, I, it was just a little bit of chapstick and it was kind of sticky and I didn't want to eat with chapstick on my fingers, so. No, totally, I get that too. Plus, I mean, you can't really, you know, play pop and bubbles and stuff with, with, you know, sticky fingers. That'll make it a lot harder. That's probably why you didn't get as high of a score, you know? If you want, I can totally help you get a higher score. It'd be fun. We could do it together. Um, yeah, uh, maybe, um, but, but first, <laughs> I wanted to tell you this awesome some joke I heard. Um, <clears throat> oh, okay. Why did the chicken cross the road? Um, <laughs> to get 
to the other side. Wait, you you've heard that one? Um, yeah, it's kind of, it's kind of like one of the oldest jokes in the book. <laughs> oh, um, well, actually, uh, um, uh, uh, stay right there, okay? Um, and uh, let me just um mess up and uh. Oh, Gregory, I think you have something behind your ear. Whoa, it's a it's a a a, a puck thing. Or... <laughs> it's an air hockey puck. That was uh, that was cool. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. I, I'm glad you like it. Um, do um, you do like magic tricks and stuff a lot? I've I've never really heard of this before. This is kind of all new. <laughs> no, I've never really done magic tricks before. Um, but uh, I, I just uh, oh, what else can I do? Um, I, I, whoa, look at me. I'm a crazy driver. Uh, have you ever played this game before? Of course I've played this game. This is Roxanne's favorite game. Oh, that, that makes sense. Um, she's probably really good at it too, isn't she? Honk, honk. <laughs> yeah, Roxanne's great at this game. Get out of the way, you, uh, slow driver. Yeah, get out of her way. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh. Uh, okay, um, uh, what else should I do? Um, what else would be funny? Uh, oh, <clears throat> well, since, uh, no one's really taken our order yet, hello, sir, can I interest you in one plate to eat? Um, yeah, <laughs> sure, right, um. All right, here's one. Oh, uh, I accidentally, oh, would you also like a napkin holder? You can have that to eat, too. Um, I don't think I really need a napkin holder, um. What is this? Oh, uh, would you also like an energy drink? Um, I don't think I really need more energy. I don't... Gregory, we can take this. It'll be really cool. You'll love it. We can take this energy drink and we can shake it up, okay? We're gonna shake it up aggressively and then we're gonna open it and it's gonna explode everywhere. It'll be hilarious. Oh, Cassie, look, um... You're acting kind of um, weird right now. No, I, I'm... Not in, like, a bad way. I don't want to, like... I'm acting funny. I, I'm being funny. You like funny, right? Yeah, I, I guess. But, um, Cassie, you don't have to try to go overboard with being funny to impress me or to make yourself look good. You, you know that, right? Oh, okay. Sorry. I... I guess I just got a little nervous is all. I, I thought I was saying all the wrong things and, um, I... I might have gotten some advice from a friend or something that said I, I should try and crack jokes and be funny because you like funny people. Um, Cassie, of course I like jokes. They're a lot of fun, but I like you for you, you know? I don't want to go on a date with someone who's just trying to make me laugh all the time. I wanted to go on a date with Cassie. You know, you're super funny naturally and you're really pretty and um you like a lot of the same food that i like and you like you think i'm pretty <laughs> well yeah of course i do okay i'm sorry i just i really wanted tonight to be perfect i i've been hoping this night would happen for a really long time you have no idea cassie i've been wanting this night to happen for a really long time too there was a lot of emotions that went behind me asking you to even come on this date in the first place and when I finally got the courage to do it and everything I went home after and honestly I was kind of in the same mindset that you are right now. I was talking to Roxanne about all the different things I could do to impress you. I wanted to slick back my hair and <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah and put on I don't know like a tuxedo or something and I haven't thought about wearing Freddy's cologne. <laughs> That's not necessary, Gregory. I, I like you just as you are. Really? Yeah. And I guess it probably goes the same for you and me. Uh, can we just maybe start over? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, Um, let, let's start from the beginning. We just walked in and uh, um, we're going to have this play out totally differently, okay? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, absolutely. All right. Whoa, Gregory, look at this place. I love eating food here. <laughs> Me too. I even love um, popping bubbles. <laughs> oh yeah. Did you did you maybe want to play or um, we can either do that or get food first or um, we can get one of their like mega gulp drinks or really do anything. Yeah, I guess the night is young. Let's do it all. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> all right, but I'm gonna beat your high score in popping bubbles first. Oh no, you aren't. <laughs> yeah, I am. No, you aren't. And play. <laughs> oh my god. Gosh, I'll be the one so much better than I could have ever expected. That was so exciting. Cassie and Gregory sitting in a tree. K-I-S-S. 
S I N G. Yeah. <laughs> All right, watch out. I'm going to close the door before my mom hears me freaking out about how well that went. I can't believe it. You were right about everything helping. All I had to do was be myself. And I mean, Gregory liked me for me. And thank you for being there for me. I, I honestly couldn't have done anything without having you to talk to. Well, of course. I'm always going to be here for you, Cassie. I'm your helpful companion, Helpy. I know. <laughs> Thanks, Helpy. I, I really appreciate it. Oh, I should be getting some uh, sleep soon. Yeah, probably. But I just wanted to let you know, Cassie. I'm really happy that we're friends now. And I'm really excited to be going on so many adventures in the future with you. I'm really excited to go on more adventures with you too, Helpy. Really? Of course. <laughs> Helpy. Yeah? Do you ever wish you weren't just an AI? Maybe so you could like talk to other people like Gregory and not just little old me? I guess I haven't really put much thought into it before. I've always been an AI and I've always kind of been stuck inside of the Vanny mask or I guess really in your head when I implemented it into you. Um, I guess it could be cool to be real, but believe me when I say I'm really just happy that we're friends and I can be with you whenever I want. Yeah, I'm glad to. I'll go ahead and get out of here so we can both get some rest, okay? All right, signing off. Bye, Helpy. <sighs> and now to get some sleep. <sighs>